Sa mas pumubuting relasyon ng Pilipinas at bansang China, mas masigla ring ekonomiya ang inaasahang resulta nito para sa bansa. Buwan naman rito ang 24 billion US dollar soft loans at investment projects na bitbit ni Pangulong Duterte mula sa kanyang pagbisita sa China. Bukod sa mga proyekto sa transportasyon, infrastruktura, isa rin sa positibong oportunidad na bubuksan ay ang paglakas ng tourism sector. Kanina sa isinagawang China-Philippines Dialogue, inihayag ni Stephen Tichico, chairman ng Uni Orient Travel Incorporated at Federation of Filipino-Chinese Associations of the Philippines ang malaking potensyal ng bansa na makaakit ng mas marami pang Chinese tourists, lalo pat inalis na ang travel warning na pumay Pigil noon sa mga Chinese na bumisita ng Pilipinas. Inire-rekomenda ngayon ni Tichiko na magkaroon ng visa-free travel para sa mga Chinese citizens. Kung pahihintulutan ito, maaaring dumoble at umabot sa 1 million Chinese tourists ang papasok sa Pilipinas sa susunod na taon. But he believes that Um, the Chinese tourists coming here this year still won't reach 1 million. So, I recommend that we have a great job because he is working to make the So, he believes that through the efforts of the ambassador, next year, hopefully, the Chinese tourists coming here will surpass the 1 million target. So why set this target of 1 million? Because Mr. Tichiko believes that if we surpass this 1 million, we also won't have the capacity in terms of hotels and our facilities to accommodate them as of now. Kung sakasakali, tiyak na magbubunga ito ng matatag na ekonomiya, lalo pat inaasahang gagastos ng hanggang $1,000 ang kada isang turista. Yun nga lang kaakibat nito, kinakailangan rin umanong maging competitive ang bansa, lalo na sa pagpapaganda ng serbisyo at imahe ng Pilipinas. Right? You would like to reach out to the media and ask your help to broadcast, to show the people that the Philippines is a good destination to come to and that we should treat our guests like, like guests and treat them you know, with hospitality. Sa panig naman ng Department of Tourism, tiniyak nito ang masigasig na kampanya ng bagong administrasyon upang mas mapaunlad pa ang turismo sa bansa. You know, we're enhancing the current uh, choice sites, of course, to visit. Uh, the provinces that are always visited by tourists, but we are also promoting new destinations. Uh, we know that uh, the local government units all over the country are also stepping up their efforts to make them more tourism friendly, uh, to provide more uh, uh, to provide more areas where tourists can go and be safe and see the beauty of the Philippines. Mary Anbastasa, News Team 13.